I watched this play, it was literally go out by itself. Every single, every single time. Oh. Demon just got out of the can. I gave my bro an advance. Okay, so welcome back to the channel today. My name's Luke and this is LBTV. For those of you that have just seen that demonstration, I can tell it's probably happened to a lot of you most of the time is that if you get to your car with a uh, load of shopping or anything, for instance, and you just want to try and get your boot open, but you've got it all in your hand, you can't put the key, you can't put the key to unlock it because you've got so much in your hands. This, in this box today, is going to save you that absolute crazy hassle. Um, but yeah, let's let's um, talk about this product a bit more Thanks. and uh, jump into this video. Okay guys, so this is a product from Emerald Struts. Now for those of you guys that don't know Emerald Struts is, I will put a, uh, like an overlay right now as to their website. Um, basically they sell struts um, with spring-loaded like boot mods basically that open your boot. As soon as you press your uh, boot unlock button, it will open your boot. They do it for loads of various models and makes. Um, go check it out. I've got a code LBTV and it will give you 10% off. But um, the cool thing about these things are is that you'll greet it with a really nice box. It looks like that. And then once you open it, you'll be able to see both the struts inside. Now, this is a very easy, nice mod to do. Um, will not take you long at all. And I believe all you're going to need is a flathead screwdriver. So let's get these unpacked and um, crack on and see how good they actually are. Also, we've had an actual proper fresh trim this time. What do you reckon, you guys? Uh, I'm, I'm rating this one a bit more compared to uh, Shannon's old bowl cut. But yeah, this one, this one's decent. We're, uh, I'm actually back with a fresh trim. I feel good. And so, you graded with these quite nice looking. These are quite flash, these aren't they? Swishy looking little struts. Got emerald struts written all over it. As you'll be able to see on here, they've got like a little, uh, if that focuses, it's like a little clip. So we can use a flathead to pull these out. But with these ones, um, on these new ones, it seems to have like, it's got like a little, um, a different type of clip. Um, to be fair, it looks like it's kind of more secure in a way, but we'll see what it's like. I've never used uh, these before. Usually they are, um, they usually have these little clips on most vehicles. So we'll be able to, it'll be interesting to see um, if I can either use these or use the um, existing ones that are on the original strut. So we'll get these on. But the way it works, guys, is that um, I'm guessing when you hit the boot release button, um, this will be like spring activated. So it'll just push off from the springs and then it will open your boot automatically for you, which I think is amazing. Like when I, you know, it's not only did I think like, yeah, you like you guys, brilliant, Luke. Oh, you're sponsored. I'm just going to say this. I genuinely was going to buy this product until I spoke to the owner of the company, um, who's actually sent me, it, sent me this out. But I've got a discount code for you guys, and I was genuinely gonna buy this product because I think it's awesome. Um, boot mods are amazing. Most cars these days come with them, you just already, they just have like electric boots. But for this nice, easy, cheap mod, um, you can do it to your car at home. It'll probably take you like 10 minutes. And yeah, it's sick. Like, what it is, it's a little strut with a little modification. I mean, pr probably not gonna lie, you could probably modify it yourself, but to have it all done and professionally done, pretty sick. So let's get in. So this one's all in and done and dusted now. I've put the clips back in. So probably the best way to do it is take the actual clips out themselves. And once you've got them out, um, pop them in nice and easy. Um, that's what I've found so far. And then after you've done that, you can just slide the clips in, which I believe go up around there. But they're really simple, easy to do. Um, I'm going to go ahead and quickly do this one as well. I'll show you guys a bit easier on camera with this one. Thingy flattered for this. This still works out of my little like twenty pound Halfords toolkit that I've got. <laughs> it's always the cheap toolkits that are the best ones. You know, that is officially done. There's two clips out. Where it all falls out, so you just have to pop it off. That one came off quite proper. That one came off so easy. That one did, but yeah, that's the old ones. And um, these are all genuine BMW ones anyway, so I'm going to keep these. Right, and then, so now we can get this one in. So remember guys, always keep the spring part on the top because if you have one round the other way, it's, it's just not gonna work. So uh, what I've done is already taken out the silver clips, which are right there, as you guys already know. And then what I'm gonna do now is just 
pop it straight in, nice and easily, hopefully. Like so. And I'm just gonna get the pins and pop them in. Easy like that. So that's the top one in. And then I'll just pop the bottom one in down here. Like so. And that's it. They're both in. All done and dusted. So the next thing I've noticed is that these are actually really solid. Remember before when I was taking out the BMW ones, um, the boot lid was actually falling down with just one in. I had one in now and this was absolutely solid. So, well, you know what's left to do now, guys, is just to uh, test it out. So I'm going to leave everything in there. Um, get these back up. These are a lot more solid. I can feel that already. Yeah, and then the is on camera, what I'll do is from like here, show you my key, uh, if it focuses on. So I'm going to hold the bottom key and should hopefully see the boot just. Look at that, how sick is that? <laughs> that is cool. To be fair, I'll give a boot that is cool. Just <laughs> kidding, mate. I was like, literally, like, what is going on? Man? Yeah, that is so sick. George, I'll show you. My card's done that already. Really? Say again. Bruh. That's cool, isn't it? Mate, I'm gassed for that. That's sick. I'm never going to have to, like, you know, if you've ever got, like, loads of shopping and that, and you're trying to get to your keys and trying to do your boot. Shopping and that, yeah. Well, whatever. So it's like, literally. <laughs> Oh mate, that's sick. Buzzing. Right guys, so there we go. I'm actually gassed over a set of like uh, boot struts. How crazy and stupid is that? But I'm gonna reenact that first clip in a minute. Just show you guys how easy it would be if you had a load of shopping in your hands, etc. Um, obviously this is made for those sort of purposes, whereas, um, you know, with newer cars, like I said, you have like the electric button where you could press and the boot opens by itself, where you just press the boot button. Um, so obviously BMW didn't do it on this model. So it'd be cool for you guys to get, you know, get your hands on a set of these. They're not very expensive and you don't have to, you know, be a whiz kid or a genius to do it. It's pretty simple. But for now, let's reenact that clip and then we can end off the video. How much easier is that? In it goes. Bush, bash, wash, shut the boot. Job done. Right, Lord, and a quick one before I do head off back into the car and end up the video. Down here, I've got uh, new stickers that I've got. I was going to show you probably last time, but I didn't get around to doing it. We've got different colours. We've got a new like LBTV logo going on. Uh, we've got them in like a Nardo grey, sort of like matched the colour of my car. We've got black. Uh, we've got loads of black ones, which looks sick. And then we've got white ones as well, just for the LBTV. And then we've gone back to having the LBTV gang stickers here as well, just in case. You know, it's like my own little community for those of you that just want to represent, you know, me as a channel LBTV. But also want to have that little, like, gang or that car culture trademark um, on your cars. Obviously, these are just, you know, representative of all of me as well. But there's these, like, a if we have these together as a group, they'll look pretty cool. But anyway, that's the that's the cool stickers. If you want to check it out, I will leave a link in the description down below. They'll be going live on the website soon. And there will also be some sick lanyards coming. We've got some LBTV lanyards coming as well, guys. So, uh, yeah, just be, be wary of that. It's going to be awesome. Right, anyway guys, there you go, all done. Emerald struts, what can I say? Absolutely insane. They fit really nice and easily. Obviously, it's the first time for me messing around with struts. Um, took me like five, five, 10 minutes max just to get that done. And to be fair, like as you can tell by my reaction, I was pretty hyped when it when I've I've never I've never done like a little mod app before. It's cool. It's like everyone's gonna be like, oh Luke, it's literally nothing. But for me, I'm gassed off it and it's uh pretty simple little easy mod it's the little things in life that keep you happy as they say but anyway guys there you go thanks for watching today's video uh, if you've enjoyed it make sure you hit that subscribe button and slap the like button as well please it means a lot to me getting those likes and if you haven't already hit that bell button to make notified every single time i upload as well guys we've got some more videos coming the wheels are arriving today so they'll be coming out this week hopefully so i can't wait to get new wheels on it's gonna be sick the car's gonna be looking naughty and uh, yeah make sure you use discount code lbtv for 10 percent off these struts i'll leave a link in the description down below and i'll also pin it as a comment on this video. Anyway guys, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.